Thunder wird vorbei, Bruder, ich bin völlig high. Ja. Mein Lächeln richtig brett und meine Beine sind durch Stein. Feinste Ware. Hello friends and welcome to a new video on this channel. I hope you are in a good mood and you are healthy. If you are new on my channel, I would like to introduce myself. I am Papa Joe, German Call of Duty mobile player and content creator. To everyone else, thanks for tuning in again. Today I'll show you all the leaks, news and updates about the new upcoming season 5 in Call of Duty mobile. We also take a look at all the character skins we can expect in season 5. Watch the video until the end and before the video starts, I want to thank you for over 95,000 subscribers on my leak video several days ago. Unbelievable and thank you to each and every one of you. You guys are the best community imaginable. Now let's get to the more interesting stuff, which is why you clicked on this video. In Battle Royale we can look forward to a new class which has already been found and tested in the public test server for Season 3. COD Mobile tests all new features in the test server or in the Chinese version before it is added to us. On Twitter, Call of Duty Mobile already confirmed with a video the new Battle Royale class for Season 5 in the game. I now show you a small gameplay of the upcoming Battle Royale class in Call of Duty Mobile from the test server for Season 3. Have fun! What do you think? Are you looking forward to the new BR class in COD Mobile? Write it in the comment. Next. Let's take a closer look at the two new weapons that are coming for the new season. First of all, I have to say that I think it's very nice that we can finally expect a new shotgun for the upcoming season. In the in-game files we found the CR-56 AIM AX Assault Rifle from Modern Warfare. The CR-56 Assault Rifle is a light weapon that helps with movement speed and recoil control. It is a deadly weapon that can hit an enemy with three chest shots or two headshots. The second weapon will finally be a new shotgun, as expected, which some may also know from Modern Warfare. The 725 shotgun will most likely appear in the seasonal challenge for the new Season 5. There are also rumors that the legendary ghost will appear with a legendary 725 shotgun. In my opinion it will be a legendary MW11 but let's wait and see. Personally, I'm very excited about both new weapons and now we're looking at the next things that can be released for Season 5. Furthermore, we can probably look forward to a new perk and a new operator skill for the new season. On a picture of Garina for Season 5 which was deleted after a few minutes, a new perk was discovered which I and many others have been waiting for. After many Call of Duty, Mobile Seasons the Green Gung-Ho perk finally appears in Call of Duty Mobile. With this perk you get a speed boost that allows you to hip fire, throw grenades and recharge while sprinting. Drop me your thoughts on it in the comments. Also, for the upcoming Season 5, we can finally expect the operator skill from Call of Duty Black Ops 4 called K9 Unit. With this operator skill you can call an attack dog which hunts down enemies in its vicinity. A faithful companion on any battlefield. 
Like if you are looking forward to this operator skill in Call of Duty Mobile. Now let's take a look at the legendary character skin that we can most likely expect in the next season. As we know, we are expecting a partially ghost-based season 5 in deep water and with the new update the legendary character skin will appear in the lucky draw. Probably the legendary ghost character will be called Dogman. I am very excited and hope that this character will be worth the money, when it is released in season 5 in the lucky draw. I'm flashing you a video of the legendary character skin in Call of Duty Mobile now, enjoy! The new Season 5 in Deepwater update in Call of Duty Mobile brings three new multiplayer maps that we will soon be able to play. The first map that will be added to the new season is called Docks from Modern Warfare. This map has already been confirmed by COD Mobile and is a smaller map compared to the other two maps, designed from the ground up for 2v2 gunfight modes. The new Soldil Harbor map is a remake of Harbor from the first Call of Duty game. The map is set at a harbor in Soldil. The harbor consists of a warehouse near the market and an office building located in front of the container area. I also have good news for all of you who have been waiting a very long time for the NA Incursion map from Modern Warfare and COD Mobile. This medium-sized map, which was first introduced in Call of Duty Modern Warfare, will be released for the new Season 5. The NA Incursion map is designed for players to enjoy 5v5 action. It has 12 zones, with the palace dominating the center. Which of the map are you most looking forward to? Post it in the comments. Now let's take a look at more information about the new Season 5 that is included in the latest community update as well as the upcoming COD Mobile Season 5 theme event. In the upcoming Season 5 we can expect a ghost and water-like theme, as a few days ago COD Mobile published several images and videos about it in their official social media channels. Furthermore, for the new Season 5 in deep water, a theme-based event will start in which we will receive free rewards. A brief description of the upcoming event, the battle lines are drawn, and a critical naval battle is about to begin. Choose your side, ghosts or the federation. Bomb your enemies as you race to conquer territory and earn rewards for completing various daily tasks. The faction with the most map nodes at the end of the event wins. What's your opinion on the new theme-based event in Call of Duty Mobile? Post it in the comments. Also, for the new season, a new epic login character skin will be released for free in Call of Duty Mobile. I'm going to show you a teaser for it and write your first impressions in the comments. Like the video if you are looking forward to the free Bathosphere character skin. For the upcoming season 5 in COD Mobile more changes to the weapon balance will be released. Already last almost two weeks ago Call of Duty Mobile launched extensive changes, but this was not the complete list, so as always we can look forward to new buffs and nerfs to the latest season. Actually, there should be a free katana for every player this season, but we are waiting in vain for the popular, sword. Now Call of Duty Mobile commented on this and said that this turned out to be a mistake and since then the team has been looking for a good opportunity to find a free way to the Katana through seasonal challenges or events. We can probably expect a free Katana for Season 5. Now let's look at all the lucky draws we can expect in the next season. 
probably the most interesting draw in season 5, is the legendary ghost character, which I already leaked last season. In the following image, we finally know what the legendary character skin will look like. I am now blending you a video of the upcoming legendary ghost character skin. Have fun. Write me your opinion about the new ghost character in the com- Furthermore, a sweet joke redux draw with the legendary RPD and practical joker, the epic Gunzo character skin and other rewards will be released for the new season. I'm really looking forward to the first Gunzo character and hope you are too. We can also expect a lucky draw in season 5, which many already know from the Chinese version. This draw comes with a legendary Type 25 skin in Magnetic Field as well as a new character skin. I'll fade in the matching Lucky Draw trailer from the Chinese version to the Lucky Draw for you. Probably the Mace in the Armorer uniform seen in the video will not be included in the Lucky Draw. Otherwise, we can expect three more lucky draws in the next season, with only the names known, as well as some of the names of the rewards. Which of the upcoming lucky draws are you looking forward to the most? Write it in the comments. Now I will show you all upcoming bundles in Call of Duty Mobile, which will be released for the new season 5. After that I want to show you all the crates for the new season. Most likely there will be 6 epic bundles and 1 blue bundle and 1 epic leaderboard reward bundle released during the new season. In the first bundle we recognize the epic GKS in the blue mercury and the M4 in the radar, blueprint. For the new season we already get another bundle with blueprints that have already been released. In addition, you get an epic knife, as well as other rewards. In the second bundle we recognize an epic blueprint for the antelope and accelerator as well as an epic blueprint for the ORV and helicopter and the epic blueprint of the same name. Many of you will be familiar with these two, skins from a crate in Season 13 Winter War. Otherwise, you get a parachute and wingsuit blueprint. In addition, the first epic grenade bundle in Call of Duty Mobile will be released for the new Season 5. This new bundle contains 3 epic blueprints for different grenades and 3 blue blueprints for 3 different grenades. With the rest of the bundles of the new season 5 you only know the name and, unfortunately not the rewards. So that was a lot. I hope you enjoyed the video and know more about what to expect in the upcoming season. For more leaks and updates on Call of Duty Mobile, subscribe to my channel and enable push notifications to not miss anything. Thanks for watching and see you next time. I'm Sie haben keine Conny Bro, tun die so auf Promino Nein, du holst ein Kombi, yo, wach auf am Morgen grau Und erstmal einen Besen, war verschlafen in die Brücken schauen Und habe Teufels rote Augen, damals zu viel Hass im Bau Schreib es auf, weil er meine Texte raus Damals lachten sie mich